get used to it. Hello, this is Ute from Ute's Herbal Witch Corner and <laughs> um, today I want to introduce you to a combo we have in three different uh, way you can take it and we have we are talking about Enkinasia or Enkinasia I still struggle with this word we have capsules it's not focusing again and we also have the tincture And, of course, we have the T, number 24. So there are three options if you are fighting the flu, the colds, or any virus infection with this weather. Um, you have the option to make your decision if you want to take a capsule, or if you want to use a tincture, or if you want to drink a tea. This is the tea, beautiful color and delicious. And I put again one spoon of honey in it and it is really, really delicious. So Echinacea is yeah, you can explore cold and flu relief with capsules, tinctures and teas, as I said. The incredible benefit of our Echinacea for relieving cold and flu symptoms and you need to taste it. It is really, really delicious if you make your decision for the tea. You can discover the power of Echinacea capsules, tinctures and teas for tackling those nasty colds and virus, flu virus effectively. So it's not just that it will, yeah, you can just take it and there is no benefits. There is a benefit. And I would say if you drink a tea, it's the fastest a benefit of Echinacea. The next one I would say is Echinacea as a tincture. It's made without alcohol. Or if you want to take it over a longer time and it's not necessary that the benefit kicked in your body immediately, you can take the capsules here. Um, so, but the capsules, they are the longest intake until it's going into your blood circulation. The fastest one is Echinacea tea or the tincture. So the capsules are convenient and easily consumable option while the contract tinctures offers a potent and fast acting. That's what I say. This takes the longest time to get in your um, blood circulation and this is fast but not so fast as the tea so <laughs> there it's all uh, everything is the same it's echinacea but it always depends how you take it in so the we also go deeper into the soothing effect of echinacea tea that's what i said it's really really delicious um the tea is perfect for for these ones or for those, sorry, for those looking for comforting and natural remedy and it's warming up your body. The capsules, it's still not focusing. Ah, oh, here we are. <laughs> so the capsules are convenient and effective way to boost your immune system packed with all the nutrients and the power of Echinacea. These capsules helps you to stay healthy and keep those viral um, invaders at bay. So they keep, in other words, it 
keeps them under control, that they cannot split and you're feeling sick with all the viruses. Um, you just take the capsule with water and you take three. Here we are. Three capsules per day. And as you can see on my label, um, in <laughs> Echinacea is also an antibiotic. So it doesn't matter if you take the capsule, the tincture, or the tea. It's also an antibiotic. So for more relief, try the tincture, as I said. Um, with a concentrated dose of Echinacea, this liquid formula uh, gets to work fast providing quick symptoms relief and helping your body fight off infections. So exactly what I said, this take long, this is fast and the tea is fast. So if you need it, if you are in the middle of a cold and you have the sticky nose or running nose, coughing and uh, fever, then I would definitely say if you prefer to take the tincture, if you don't like to take the tincture, um, try the tea. So the <laughs> yeah, the ultimate warmth and comfort include the soothing cup of our tea. That's what I said. It's warm and you feel the tea going down and your whole body is feeling cozy <laughs> which is the effect with every tea so again this is the tea I put one spoon of honey in it and it's so aromatic and it's I don't even know the taste um, the, do you know how the flower looks like the echinacea it's I'm sure you have it in your backyard because they are uh, growing wild and they have and I will put or Ken will put a picture um, on this video they are purplish and they are beautiful and as I said they are growing wild so I'm sure you have seen them in your yard they are healthy and you can use everything you can use the whole plant if you want to try to make yourself a tea but you have to try the plant and yeah it's it's a different story but it's a in your yard and i'm sure it's in our yard everywhere and it's spreading on its own i mean you can buy seeds but this is wasting money for my opinion because every um, plant of the echinacea when they're done with blooming, they have the seeds and you can go ahead and dry the seeds or let the wind and the nature do his job and it will spread all over your yard. So really, really, really beautiful. So as I said, whenever you prefer the capsules, the tinctures or the tea, we got you covered. So, with all the information you need to unlock the power of Enchinacea, <laughs> this is such a terrible word, um, you unlock the power and the maximum cold and flu relief. But, be careful. I have to say that this is a warning. Patients who suffer from autoimmune disease such as uh, multiple sclerosis who have received or have received an organ transplant or have a weakened immune system for example due, uh, due to AIDS um, or tuberculosis should consult their doctor before they take any echinacea echinacea capsules, tinctures or tea so if you have some of this um, experience then please contact your doctor and ask if you can take with your health um, echinacea in capsule tincture or as a tea so you're still there <laughs> hello <laughs> I love it um, 
So yeah, this was Echinacea. We have, as I said, the capsules. The capsules are the number 27. Then we have the tincture, no alcohol. And the tincture is the number 12. And of course the tea, which is number 24. Did I make something wrong? Echinacea is 12. <laughs> Um, the capsules are 27 and the tea is 24. Oh my God. So, and, but this has nothing to do and will not help you with your cold or your flu. We also have Echinacea cream or soft. So the Echinacea soft, um, let me read it because I don't have anything and everything in my mind. Um, is for wounds, stings, and when you have spider bites or such nasty things. So this is the the salve, which has no effect on a cold or a flu. But this is just to let you know, we have four, if you want to say so, four different products out of one plant. So, and this is the beautiful thing with... Um, the natural alternative medicine out of one herbs as you have here the explanation we can make at least one two three four and i'm sure i could be able to make an oil out of this as well but the oil would be the same effect like the soft okay so chung chung. as always i am your master herbalist i cannot and i will not give you any medical advice, all the information we are sharing in our educational videos, um, are our own experience or from our friends, family or customers. And this will be never ever a medical advice. If you have any um, health question, may you contact your doctor. All right. So this was the beautiful and powerful plant called Echinacea and again I apologize the pronunciation for this plant name is hard <coughs> excuse me so and this was the video for today and I'm getting confused with the numbers I think we are by 91 or even higher um, we would love to see you subscribing to our YouTube channel. So therefore you can see all our um, our herbal products we have here in the shop, how we make them, how we try to taste them and all the information they are helping you um, when you're thinking about going to um, alternative medicine away from over the counter or whatever. So yeah, this was Ute from Uta's Herbal Witch Corner. Bye bye. Ciao, ciao. Love and light. See you soon. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye.